Hi, this is the weekly horoscope for Aquarius for the week of October 23rd, 2023. <laughs> Hello, my airbenders. Show your love and support to your girl, Marie. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. I will be doing the yearlies, the six months, the natal charts, the compatibility reports. The yearlies and the six months, I will not be doing the tarot, nor the numbers of the auspicious days and inauspicious days, because... People have interceptions, and it takes too damn long, okay? It's like, basically, it's a book, okay? By the time I'm done. So, this is not the easiest energy time. You do have a stellar with your ninth house and your third house and your tenth house um, here. So, a lot of opposition with the North Node. So, your timing of things can be off at this time. Plus, we have the lunar eclipse coming up. So, check out the... Um, the nodes on the glossary page to see how the stellum in the south node in the ninth house in the south node which would be your north node in your fourth house is going to affect you at this time okay so we have the lunar eclipse coming up on friday which i talk about in the monthly horoscopes as well arrows is in retrograde we have the earth transiting this week and the sign of aries and then on the 26th going to move into the sign of taurus and you're into your fourth house with this energy and we have the north node here so arrows is the higher form of mars the god of war is in retrograde at this time so you just feel things a little bit more intensely for some of you this could be dealing with car problems with this energy here or there's a lack of transportation in your life at this time or the, like the transits could be like delayed at this time you may not have patience um for anybody you could be really straightforward and honest with your speech so you really need to cock those damn brains before you shoot that damn mouth off you are at the wrong place at the wrong time this week so don't even try it okay um you can be getting into power struggles with certain people in your life here because there's a lot of energy between your ninth and tenth house this could be fighting with landlord property managers um no, and I'm fighting with important relationships at this time. For some of you, this is you needing to handle your responsibilities, like your personal responsibilities, like your passports, your visa. You could have problems with immigration at this time, INS with this energy here for some of you. For others of you, this could be dealing with like important love relationships like marriages that are 14 to 20 to 30 years old um, right now, okay? Then on t the 24th, you ca are explosive and unpredictable. Um, you have a hard time controlling your emotions, you're impulsive, you have tantrums and you have tiaras, darling. You're just everywhere. You're just everywhere. And it's like so fabulous. You're like a hot mess of lava and I'm just loving it. I'm loving the beautiful chaos in your life. Okay, you're powerful and you're good at rising to challenges. You need to learn to compromise. You suffer from obsessive thoughts and find it difficult to think positively and calmly. You're focused on your own thoughts and opinions and you may not listen to others at this time. Try not to focus too much on yourself. Others may put you off, be put off by your vanity, but also it could be a situation where you like live by yourself or something. So you have nothing to talk about but yourself, okay? You're sensitive of, or you're not over certain people or certain situations. So that's all you could talk about at this time. Your sense of what is beautiful is not popular. Avoid overindulgence or gluttony. You may be prone to miss opportunities that present themselves in your community due to habit. You may not feel like talking much or you could be feeling depressed you may feel isolated or lonely um, now or you have to talk or you um, have to talk about serious matters with this energy to older relatives communications with others can be very difficult or delayed temporarily you may not be getting along with live-in relationships this could be um, a breakup happening with this energy on the 25th let me see this may be a time when others see you as an authority figure. For some of you, this could be dealing with you being a teacher or a trainer, and you could be training other people at this time, or you could be training interns with this energy. It is a time of advancement in career and opening up opportunities for advancement. It is a good time for public speaking as your words seem to come easily. This is fairly a positive influence upon your career, so as long as you do not promise more than you can deliver, avoid imposing on others this can be a time of disturbance with the home you may move to more spacious surroundings but it may have flaws 
like the grass isn't always greener on the other side so just be prepared for that career advancement is possible superiors see your worth to the company in favorable light but be careful not to overvalue yourself um, with this energy victory after resistance is happening be careful with your superiors do not see you as a threat to their position this can also be um, you taking on more responsibilities and steady progress towards your goals then on the 26th it is a good time for dealing with the public promotions communications displaying products career changes may be in the focus you may um, get a fresh start in career or it may be time to make important decisions regarding career personal issues weigh heavy on your mind in professional consideration you may have trouble getting recognition from others or getting noticed for for your career efforts your creativity and imagination is high but that's not necessarily a good thing either because you could be literally running away with your imagination and assuming things and your trust issues with other people are just going to come out at this time because you're sitting here trying to predict stuff and it could be way off so what you think you know you don't so don't go assuming um this could be a time where you could be a move could be happening for some of you you may not be getting along with your partner or boyfriend or girlfriend at this time you could decide to move because of hoh your manager i'm not your manager your property manager or your landlord okay and or neighbors and you could be like butting heads with them you could be like wanting to move far away as possible all right this could also be a love relationship as well so you two could be fragile in a fragile place at this time so you're really not trying to call them or trying to rock the boat um, you're just trying to see what's going on with the relationship um, with this energy the person at this time could be giving you the silent treatment so you don't know where you stand with this person and then on the 27th your perceptions of others feelings are probably not accurate at this time so don't go assuming you may expect the worst out of people communication is very confusing your feelings aren't very clear to you you seem to react more to opinions of other people especially when you feel that they threaten your security you're likely to take things too personally um, you should avoid getting into emotional discussions that serve little to no purpose this organization and chaos will be more frustrating and hectic pace of business may leave you exhausted allow time in your day to retreat and catch your breath you should always avoid discussing important issues about your home or postpone family meetings until like maybe next week okay because we have the lunar eclipse on saturday you may feel like making decisions about your personal life but it's probably better to postpone it um, for a later period maybe when saturn goes direct okay it may not be a good time to act on your feelings and instincts you may need to defend yourself against attack if you have children this may be um this may be when you try to test they try to test your limits your domestic environment is best is best unsettled and hectic and at worst is probably violent but most of the time this is the energy expresses itself as a hectic time attending to the needs of others around you especially at home try to understand your unconscious motivations at this time by paying close close attention to your dreams they will reveal clearly what is really going on in your personal life relationships with women regardless of what sex you are is very stormy this week okay the first card to come up with is the seven of swords you're very quiet you're non-communicative at this time and your lack of communication with your partner could be um, be um could be um, affecting the situation okay so it could be causing a lot of emotional strife at this time the night of coin the night of wands the this is new beginnings coming up and new people coming into your life at this time with this energy the ace of wands this is taking creative risk at this time as well and this could be you being very open to new things and new possibilities coming up for you all right the seven of wands i feel like this is a great time for communications for you you find ways to defend yourself at this time or convert other people's arguments into your own the high priestess card trust your intuition the three of swords be careful of manipulative people at this time with this energy so you could be definitely getting into some power games emotional power games with your partner or with your ex with this energy here um the nine of cups my yes card whatever question i answered is yes but you're going to rely more on your intuition so this is something that you may not do right away okay the um, world card the world works in your favor i feel like a creative solution locks a long-held dream the ace of cups there's luck with love 
the sun card i feel that this could be you standing out more with this energy and others are seeing you more um, in a better light this week or this is your unique talents this is recognition and fame a lot of attention around you this is a great time for family this is a great time for creators this is a great time for mastering your love life the queen of swords i feel with this energy here that this could be dealing with a dominating woman in your life you could also be an entrepreneur with this energy the nine of wands this could be going into a collaboration or a business opportunity with somebody else but you may not be so quick to jump okay and instead you need to mull over it because you got too many planets in libra so you're not so quick or you don't really know that person well enough too many planets in scorpio so you're not so quick to jump into any new situations or new relationships with other people instead you want to take your time and get to know this person there could be problems with communications with children this week as well with this energy here the wheel of fortune card expect the unexpected there could be a turn of events coming up for you. The Ten of Swords, you could be starting over in certain areas of your life. This is a reversal of fortune. The rich shall be poor and the poor shall be rich, okay? The Hangman card, indecisions are coming up at this time. This is a time for introspection, but it's going to feel more like an anxiety attack because not a lot of things are happening at this time because of the Stellum in Libra and because of all that opposition that you have in your 10th house. So things are very slow moving for you during this time period. I feel also you're unable to communicate your point of view at this time because you're scared of confrontation with this energy here as well i feel for some of you here you're unable to protect your boundaries properly with other people in your life with this energy the page of swords listen to your own wisdom and advice this week with this energy the seven of coins something heavy on your mind but you're not going to do anything about it this week okay so this might take three weeks or three months before you do something about it the six of cups you can be sentimental about the past with this energy here as well um for some of you here this is not the easiest time for your children so they could be having some kind of difficulties or they're not getting along with either you or the other parent at this time so there's difficulties around that the ace of coins mastering your money situation you have a lot of luck on your side with career so career could do luck well your personal life not so much so okay um for some of you, you could be moving in with a partner with this energy the empress card for some of you could be moving in with mother with this energy or a sibling a female sibling and um yeah and i feel like this could be a perfect opportunity for others of you, you could be dealing with obsessive thinking with this energy the page of coins i feel other people in your life could find you reliable or trustworthy with this energy so expect to be busy you could be more about nurturing your home at this time and wanting to feed feel like for some of you here you could be finding your path from childhood at this time you could be coming in full circle with certain things that are going on there's an emphasis on your children this week with this energy here okay the knight of swords this is a very busy week for you there's a reconciliation coming up for you as well so trust your intuition on that i feel also there could be another source of income coming for you somebody could be spying on you somebody could be very critical of you the two of cups i feel for some of you here this is somebody emotionally supporting you at this time this could be a new love coming in with this energy but this person's very cautious about coming in so but this person may um unexpectedly message you and let you know about their feelings for you so this is somebody that you already know the six of coins i feel like this is a time of destiny and fate also with this energy somebody in your life could be very generous for you and helpful the justice card major decisions are coming up something heavy on your mind for some of you this could be dealing with court and court could take a while here with this energy okay um i feel like you could could be get winning money from core either inheritance or winning money from core or this could be a car accident getting money for a car accident kind of situation okay um i see that happening and the star card manifesting what you want wish fulfillment you could be more of a humanitarian at this time with this energy here and wanting to do something to give to the community for others of you you want to show your talents to you want to like write a song you know about like what's going on and stuff like that um and you want to be about bigger picture you want to help lighten the mood about like what is all going on in the world around you today okay so yeah i see that happening Alrighty, show your love and support to your girl Marie and make sure to like, subscribe, and share. Kisses. Mwah.